Hello students. Uh, today we are continuing the topic area of parallelogram and triangle. और आज भी हम थर्म्स ही करेंगे आज के जो थर्म्स बेस्ड होंगे वो एरिया ऑफ ट्राइंगल पे बेस होंगे सो प्रीवियस लेक्चर में फोर थर्म्स हुए थे थर्म नंबर फाइव थर्म नंबर फाइव स्टेटमेंट है इफ ए ट्राइंगल इफ अ ट्राइंगल एंड अ पैरोलोग्राम एंड अ पैरोलोग्राम आर ऑन द सेम बेस आर ऑन द सेम बेस एंड बिटवीन बिटवीन सेम पैर लाइन्स then the area of triangle is equal to half of the area of parallelogram again this is also a theorem so we need systematic steps first of all given and what we are given we need a diagram first in the given we need diagram first so we have to draw a parallelogram should look like a parallelogram and a triangle first name the parallelogram what is the name of the parallelogram a b c d and a triangle on the same base triangle should be on the same base this is triangle having same base ab and this point is p e. this point is p e. now we have to write first of all we have to write the given things now what we are given we are given parallelogram abcd and triangle abe on the same base ab and between and between same parallel ab and ec this is we are given this abcd abcd is a parallelogram and abe is a triangle and what we have to prove to prove we have to prove that area of triangle abe is equals to half of area of parallelogram abcd now we are talking about area and we know that area of triangle is given by half base into height and area of parallelogram is given by base into height so we need construction construction of the altitude in the triangle and the height in the parallelogram so we are constructing draw el this is the symbol for perpendicular el perpendicular to ab and bm is perpendicular to cd now construct in diagram also first of all we extend ab in this way and draw a perpendicular from e and a perpendicular from point d 
or we can uh, draw perpendicular from B also on CD. This is point M, and this one is point L. Now we have the given things. We have to prove. We have construction. Now we can start proving things. Proof. We can start with any one of the two criteria. One is area of parallelogram. One is area of triangle. We are starting with area of triangle. Area of triangle ABE. Area of triangle ABE. We know the base of AB is AB. So half AB into half AB into EL. Now, area of parallelogram, area of parallelogram is base which is AB and height which is BM. But but this BM is equals to EL. And why they are equal? We should write in the bracket why they are equal. The reason behind is distance between distance between two parallel lines two parallel lines AB and CD because the distance between two parallel lines are remain same always that's why BM is equals to EL now we can write therefore area of parallelogram area of parallelogram the name of the parallelogram is ABCD is given by AB into EL. What we are doing here? We are replace, replacing BM by EL because BM is equal to EL. So area of parallelogram ABCD is AB into EL and we have to give the equation numbers also that it will be 1 and it will be 2 so from 1 and 2 from 1 and 2 here AB into EL here half of AB into EL so the relation is area of triangle ABE is equals to half of area of parallelogram ABCD and one more important step is remaining that is and screw. Now next theorem first of all we need to write the statement this is theorem number 6 and the statement is we know very well the statement just we have to recall that triangle it should be triangles triangle on the same base and between the same parallel lines between the same parallel lines are equal in area triangle on the same base and between same parallel lines are equal in area again the given things given is we are given two triangles triangle abc and triangle B F C are on the same base on the same base and the same base is same base is B C and between same parallel lines and parallel lines are B C and D E. It should be more clear with the help of the diagram should be more clear with the help of the diagram so let us draw the diagram we need to draw two triangles one is uh, let us draw first of all two parallel lines that is first parallel line d e and second one is should look like parallel b c now we have to draw two triangles this is triangle a b c point a is there and this is triangle bfc 
point f is there and this one now this is the given triangles and again we are talking about the area so before writing the construction we need to write what we have to prove to prove area of triangle abc is equals to area of triangle bcf and then we know very well we are talking about area of triangle so we need base as well as altitude so in construction we have to construct the altitudes of triangle abc as well as of triangle bfc this is the altitude for abc and we name it al now this is the altitude for triangle bfc bfc and this is the point n har ek student ko ye pata hona chahiye ki obtuse angle triangle ka altitude bahar aa sakta hai bfc jo triangle hai uska altitude bahar aa raha hai we exceed bc and uska altitude fm jo triangle ke bahar aa raha hai now we have to write in construction what we are construct this is very simple draw al is perpendicular to bc the sign is perpendicular for perpendicular and fm is perpendicular to again bc now we can start to prove proof from where a student has to have to start no need to worry you can start with any one of the triangle आप ट्राइंगल एबीसी के एरिया से स्टार्ट कर सकते हैं आप ट्राइंगल बीएफसी के एरिया से स्टार्ट कर सकते हैं यू हैव द बेस यू हैव द एल्टीट्यूड सो स्टार्ट विद एनी वन नाउ वी आर स्टार्टिंग विद ट्राइंगल एबीसी सो एरिया ऑफ ट्राइंगल एबीसी इज वेरी सिंपल हाफ बेस बेस इज बीसी एंड एल्टीट्यूड इज ए एल राइट डाउन द क्वेश्चन नंबर वन अगेन area of triangle f b c is equals to half base is same bc and into height is fm equation number 2 again we have a reason what is the reason that this al is equals to fm now everyone should very clear why they are equal this this al is equals to fm why they are equal the reason is same distance between two parallel lines bc and de that's why they are equal so we can write therefore area of triangle fbc can be written half bc into we can replace this fm by this al because fm is equals to l here we can put al in place of fm so i am writing al here this is equation number 3 now from equation number 1 and 3 what we have this abc triangle abc having area half bc into l this triangle fbc having area equal to half bc into l so from 1 and 3 equation number 1 and 3 area of triangle abc is equals to area of triangle fbc and the last important step is hence prove now one and last theorem of this chapter which is very important theorem number 6 or 7 theorem number 7 statement it's very common statement very easy statement median of a triangle median of a triangle divides it into two triangles of equal area now first of all you should very clear about the median what is median median is the uh, line segment joining the vertices to the midpoint of opposite side let us have some rough work here to understand the median this is the triangle 
this is one of the vertices a b c one of the vertices is a and this one is the midpoint of opposite side so this is median now in this particular theorem we have to write the given things so we have to rub this no need to this triangle before writing the given things we need to draw the diagram also so the diagram we have a triangle name of the triangle a b c this one is midpoint so ad is median now write down the given things we are given triangle abc in which ad is median very simple thing abc triangle we are given with a median ad then to prove we have to prove that the statement look at the statement median of a triangle divides it into two triangle of equal area so here we can observe that ad divide triangle abc in two parts one is triangle abd one is triangle adc and we have to prove that both are equal we have to prove area of triangle abd is equals to area of triangle adc maje ki baat ye hai ki again we are talking about the area of the triangle so what we need to construct we need to construct altitude so we are constructing altitude it will be e point this is perpendicular so write down the construction draw ae perpendicular to bc now we can start proof i hope every one should very habitual about these steps given to prove construction so we can start proof in the proof again wahi maje ki baat ye hai ki hum कहीं से भी स्टार्ट कर सकते हैं एरिया ऑफ ट्राइंगल ए बी डी एरिया ऑफ ट्राइंगल ए डी सी वी आर हैविंग द बेस वी आर हैविंग द एल्टीट्यूड सो वी हैव टू राइट एरिया ऑफ ट्राइंगल ए बी डी इज इक्व टू हाफ ए बी डी बेस इज बी डी हाफ बी डी इन टू एल्टीट्यूड इज ए इक्वेशन नंबर वन एरिया ऑफ ट्राइंगल ए डी सी हाफ बेस ए डी सी में बेस क्या होगा सी डी नाउ अगेन लुक एट द डायग्राम ए डी सी अगेन इज एन ऑप्टिज एंगल ट्राइंगल इसका एल्टीट्यूड बाहर आएगा बाहर आ रहा है देन बेस सी डी एल्टीट्यूज इज अगेन ए ई अगेन वी हैव टू राइट समथिंग बट बट ए डी इज मीडियम and ad is median of triangle abc so median kya kaam karta hai base ko two equal parts mein divide karta hai so this bd should equals to this dc so we can replace this cd first of all let us write area of triangle adc is equals to half we can replace this cd with bd Half BD into AE equation number two and from one and two area of triangle ABD is equals to area of triangle ADC. This is very important here and we done that. Now, इस चैप्टर के थर्म्स हो चुके हैं. Next lecture onwards में हम इसके क्वेश्चंस प्रैक्टिस देखेंगे ठीक